Hey you guys, Jay here, just doing a quick update on the uh, 49 Merc, the Big Boss Gym build. Uh, just working away slowly at it. <clears throat> just whenever I get a couple, a couple minutes, I'll come down and put some time in on the bench here. And it seems to be working really good. So I'm just slowly getting progress done on it. So getting some paint laid down. Um, got the motor somewhat built. That's what it's looking like. looking like everything's just kind of placed on there not glued I'm going to run uh, run some spark plug wires on it um, going to put some fuel lines on it and all that good stuff uh, so that's where we're at with the motor door panels I just got <coughs> ended up in that green and black scheme I was talking about, seats as well, I'm going to do some seat belts, I'm just kind of getting the size I want, and, and then I'll, I put some speakers I'm thinking in the back there, on the top, sorry if it's loud upstairs, my kids are, Saturday morning my kids are up and playing, so sorry about that guys, um, this quick, here's the frame, went with the, the green chassis against the, the black, um, floor pan. Just kind of painting everything and mocking it up still right now. I painted both hoods. Uh, I think I'm going to go with the louvered hood here. I guess the one I like the best is going to look good for the, the rat rodish kind of look I'm going after here. Here's the tires. Thanks to uh, thanks to Paul Turley, to Turley. Um, showed you how to do the little white walls. Chris at Classic Plastic I seen did it too. He uh He's done it before, and that's kind of where I got the idea from from it. And then, and I actually went out after I seen Chris's video and picked up one of those uh, stencils. So that was just right here. Just one of these little stencils here is all you need. Do white walls on any any tires you want. I just went with that one and sprayed them on. Uh, um, I wanted this steely rim in there. I didn't like the other one. The other one was like a chrome hubcap almost. And I thought it might might look kind of weird painted. Uh, green and that's why I ended up going with this rim but these rims wouldn't fit in the other tires that came with the kit with the white wall so <clears throat> long story short we made our own white walls and and went like that but yeah that's what the rims look like um, the body is up here I stripped the paint on the uh, stripped the paint on the front and went like with the grill like that Right now it's just kind of like this. Got a few little blemishes I got to touch up uh, on this side here, and then I'm just going to uh, clear coat it in this. Uh, Pick some of this up the other day. It's a satin clear or flat clear to keep that flat look I've got going on. <clears throat> but yeah, I'm gonna go with the original bumper on it. I'm not gonna go with the, uh, the custom one that it comes with. I think this original bumper with the Original bumper with the grill looks kind of neat on it. But yeah, guys, that's kind of what she's looking like right now. And so she'll look with the tires, and I think it's looking all right. It's coming together. Like I guess I'm not getting a whole lot of time at the bench, so um, it is slowly coming though. But, and then I threw some paint. Another little update. I threw some paint on the Chevy cheeseburger build here. As I was waiting for stuff to dry on that one, I thought. Got the paintbrush out, I might as well, the airbrush out, I might as well let her rip. So, and then this has to be repainted. Because I can never paint something once. Uh, it seems like I was going to do two, three takes at it, but the body went on good. I'm going to give it a light sand and maybe another coat and then, and then clear after that. But this, yeah, I just had some fish eyes in it. Um, so I noticed after it was done, so I just threw it in the purple pond and I'll redo it get it done but yeah that's that's about it guys the hood came out all right <clears throat> so just a little update that I am down at the bench here working away um, just get like I said get some time in there's the dash I think that's all I'm gonna do on the dash but but yeah so right now I just want to
focus on getting the interior together. Uh, I'm going to wire the motor with some detail masters. Go with this this uh, wire here, the green stuff, with their little detail masters wiring kit. Uh, I actually ordered some stuff from Extreme Scale Detail that I, uh, I'm waiting on too for this build. Um, and that should be in any day here or that, like when I started it. So, and it ships like. I placed the order, and about two hours later, I got an email back saying it was uh, it was mailed. So <clears throat> it's really quick. So I'll be here any day. But... And there's the, the steering wheel. Yeah, guys, I'm liking it so far. I think the colors are, are looking good. Um, everything's coming together. So everything's pretty much painted now. It's just a matter of putting it together and uh, going from there. But. Let you guys go. Just want to make a quick update. Show you I am. I am doing something. <laughs> like I said working on kind of both the Chevy Cheeseburger build and the and the Big Boss Gym. But this is how she's going. Let me know what you think. Uh, colors are you know any good or stuff like that. But <clears throat> hopefully next time uh, I do an update, I'll have it all the interior together, the motor done, that kind of thing, and just in the final stages of assembly and get some uh, that cheeseburger build going too. I got some good ideas for it and. Hopefully get that one finished up and and uh, go from there and get into the box stock build. Sorry I didn't get into the cancer awareness. I, I've actually had a few family members um, have cancer. My mom and my grandpa both had uh, my mom had breast cancer. Uh, my grandpa he had lung cancer. He didn't make it. Uh, my mom did survive. Thank goodness. But um, yeah, so it was. It's <clears throat> watching everybody's builds and really hits home when you guys start talking about stuff like that. But like I said between these two builds and just a lot on my plate here, I I just didn't. I, I really wanted to, but it, I, you know, I have three or four models on the go, and I just I feeling of uh, not getting anything done. So, but I am watching everybody's. A really cool, really cool thing everybody's doing. Can't wait to see everybody's finished build and all that good stuff. But anyways, guys, I'll let you go, and uh, until the next update, talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Bye. -bye.